Father, we thank you for this time, this new season. We thank you for your daughter, Kelly, whom you've created, loved, and poured out your heart throughout her life. And your son, Esau, a man after your own heart, who you're preparing to lead and serve as they enter into this new season. We invite your presence today, Father, and ask you, Holy Spirit, to be at the center of our hearts. In Jesus' name we pray. And so in preparing for this new season, Kelly and S.O. have been intentional in focusing on the meaning and the purpose of marriage. You see, in marriage, you have an opportunity to grow closer to your spouse than anyone else in their entire lives. Because when you start off, you have this opportunity to know some of the deepest aspects of their hearts, their aspirations. You see, love is not just a feeling, but love is a decision. And that's a decision that prompts action. And so this decision here today and as you step into this marriage, it drives not only action today, not only action tomorrow, but for the years to come. And that's an action that prepares you. And it's an action that blesses your future children and your future family from generation to generation. And so I believe God has a very specific plan for your guys' lives and has brought you here today, brought all of us here today as witnesses, not only to support you, but to also be blessed by you, by the example that you get to set. And so we are so excited, so honored to be here today. Now before God, before your families and friends, I now pronounce you husband and wife. As so, you may kiss your bride. Although we didn't become friends until you went away to college and I realized how much I actually missed you. But since then you've become the one who has always been there for me when I've needed you. Today this couple has taken an important step in life. They've chosen to move forward together as husband and wife. I've grown to trust that Esau will protect, honor, love, and respect Kelly. So Esau, I am so thankful that my sister has found a wonderful man like you and I'm so blessed to be gaining you as a brother-in-law tonight. I think that we all deserve a love unconditional like the one S.O.U. and Kelly have. And for all of those who know Kelly better than I don't know her, we all know that it's more than just her outer beauty. It's her kind heart that have made her been loved by all of us who are here today and that capture his heart and that capture all of our family's heart. And may God bless your marriage. May you guys love each other always, even when you hate each other. To death do you apart. To Kelly and Saul. So.